Welcome back to Shibkai, everyone. Currently, Apple is preventing customers from purchasing Shiba Inu coins. Shiba News Today, Apple plans to impose a 30% tax on any petrol costs related to NFT transfers made via the wallet app, according to Coinbase. Coinbase, meanwhile, asserts that this is not feasible. We'll discuss Apple's limitations on purchasing Shiba Inu coins in this video. Shiba News for today. Remember to give the video a huge thumbs up, share it, and subscribe to the channel to see our most recent articles on expert analysis and Shiba Inu price forecasts. Let's get the video started right now. On December 3rd, let's see what Shiba Inu is up to. Shiba Inu's pricing exhibits a surprisingly optimistic picture that may soon spark a huge surge. Shiba's price is reaching a turning point that may lead to a huge bullish rise that propels it up 35% to 0.00125. This change has a strong likelihood of happening for two reasons. The price of Shiba Inu is presently around 0.933, which is the monthly support level. There's a good chance Shiba will take off from here as well because this barrier can resist four bearish assaults. This view is further supported by the widely used momentum indicator, the Relative Strength Index, RSI. A bullish divergence, which occurs when momentum rises but the price action does not match, has been produced by this indicator. This technical setup leads to a trend reversal in the bull's favor. Investors should thus watch for the Shiba Inu price to retest the next significant barrier, which is located at 0.127. Shiba can clear the 0.202 hurdle if the level is flipped into a support floor, even though this move would only result in a 35% gain. On the other hand, investors might profit by 124% from this surge. It is not impossible for the Shiba price to rise by the predicted 124%. In contrast to the criteria of the original main currencies, Shiba must maintain above the monthly support level of 0.933. If this level were to break on a high period chart, purchasers might become disinterested and decide to sell their holdings, which would lead to a sell off. A move like this might drive the price of Shiba Inu to 0.689. Shiba tokens would need to skyrocket above 10,800,000 from where they were trading last week in order to catch up to the US dollar. Five things would have to happen in order for such a massive gain to happen. The impending introduction of Sharyam, a layer 2 blockchain with the goal of drastically reducing transaction fees, is what matters most for Shiba. Built on the Ethereum network, Shiba Inu is an ERC20 token. Ethereum is a very reliable network, but because of its widespread use, transaction costs and processing times are often inflated. In order to fulfill the project's goals of creating a blockchain-based gaming platform, Sharyam is essential to significantly reducing these fees. Second, the eventual release of non-fungible token-driven games builds on the first argument. The ability for users to own their works and purchase or sell NFTs on markets is a crucial feature of blockchain-based games. Until Sharyam is released and transaction fees are significantly lowered, these marketplace transactions can be unaffordable. Third, there needs to be a significant increase in merchant acceptance for Shiba Inus. While developers are primarily concentrated on Sharyam's impending release and Shiba's potential in the metaverse, Shiba needs to find practical applications in order to establish a floor price for its tokens. Shiba needs to be approved by well-known retailers in order for its value to soar to $1. Fourth, according to CoinMarketCap, a sizable quantity of coin burn would be required to lower the projected 549 trillion outstanding tokens. In 2021, Vitalik Buterin, the inventor of Ethereum, transferred over 410 trillion Shiba to an inactive blockchain address, significantly lowering the amount in circulation. In 2023, a comparable expenditure would most likely be required to make a difference. Finally, to moonshot over 10,800,000 per in 2023, Shiba would require an unprecedented level of support and buzz on social media discussion boards. Shiba coins are stored in more over 1.25 million wallets, according to Etherscan. For the great majority of these individuals to mobilize support for an asset that exemplifies the potency of FOMO, they would need to be engaged on social media. 
Shiba News, six transactions were made and 8,375,655 Shiba were burned in the past 24 hours, resulting in a tiny 36% increase in burn rate. 50 transactions and 26,452,790 Shiba tokens burned over the previous seven days. Compared to the previous week, when 2,123,456 Shiba tokens were burned, this amount is smaller. Shiba was trading at 0.0093 on December 3rd somewhat lower than it had been the previous day following a rise from lows of 0.0081 on November 22nd. As the days pass, the range of the Shiba has continued to narrow. This could indicate that a change is possible, however it's unclear how big. There is a greater possibility of consolidation before the major move because the daily RSI has flattened. Shiba announced in February that it would be integrating with Well, an Italian burger establishment. In order to facilitate community participation in decision-making, the DAO concept was proposed. Wells' DAO approach was put to the test at the recent introduction of its decentralized organizational group, DOG, as mentioned in a blog post. Community members were given the duty of selecting the finest interior design in late November from a sample of three proposals provided by Moss ESP, the partner design business. Future decisions made and communicated to members of the Well community will use the DOG model to gain insight into potential franchise locations. This will entail choices about menu items, packaging, franchise locations, and shop design. Furthermore, 15% of future net store earnings will be distributed to Shiba holders, and the community of Shiba Inus will utilize a separate DAO to determine how best to employ those monies. Since Apple released its tough new NFT restrictions in October, Coinbase Wallet iOS app has not supported NFT transactions. It is possible that you have observed that the iOS version of Coinbase Wallet no longer allows NFTs to be transmitted. The Coinbase Wallet account tweeted on Thursday, This is due to Apple preventing our most recent app release until we turned off the feature. On Apple's mobile app store, NFTs are subject to a hefty transaction tax of 30%. If developers cannot meet that requirement, their apps will be withdrawn from the store, even if they aren't formally prohibited. Coinbase claims that Apple intends to impose a 30% tax on any gas expenses, that is, fees related to Ethereum network transactions, that are related to NFT transfers made using the wallet app. Coinbase, meanwhile, asserts that this is not feasible. Anyone who knows anything about the workings of blockchains and NFTs will tell you that this is obviously not possible. Coinbase claims that we couldn't comply even if we wanted to since Apple uses a proprietary in-app purchasing system that isn't compatible with cryptocurrencies. Every transaction a user makes on the Ethereum network incurs a fee known as gas. Without these fees, the network cannot function even if they are moving an asset like another wallet. They are outside the purview of a single organization and are more complex than a flat fee. Measuring in GUI but paid for an ETH, the price of gas fluctuates based on Ethereum network activity and how well a smart contract's code performs. More seasoned users also have the option to pay more to have their transactions appear higher on the list. Coinbase is enraged by Apple's limitations on its mobile application comparing Apple's actions to Apple's desire to collect fees for each email sent via open internet protocols. The controversial in-app purchase tax implemented by Apple has angered many cryptocurrency supporters, including Tim Sweeney, CEO of Epic Games, who filed a lawsuit against the company's practices and said that the tech giant has to be stopped. Following a similar path, Polygon Studios CEO Ryan Wyatt, formerly an executive at YouTube, has declared Apple's 30% tax to be illegal. Wyatt claims that the tax's stranglehold on the industry will impede technological innovation indefinitely. The billionaire CEO of Twitter, Elon Musk, had previously voiced concerns that Apple will take Twitter out of its retail locations. Tim Cook, the CEO of Apple, apparently allayed Musk's anxieties during their subsequent meeting on Wednesday. We're done for today. Remember to hit the thumbs up, share, and subscribe to the channel in order to watch our most recent videos.nft2